Good morning. Y'all, I just had the most traumatic experience riding in the car with the Cannot drive. Yes, I can. You can't accept the fact that I am a NASCAR driver. I drive. She's fast. a wannabe NASCAR driver. I like to get. There. In order to be drive fast, you gotta be skilled at driving first. Bitch, you can't I'm just. Skilled. You can't just drive fast and drive fast. She just drive fast. She don't. What? Oh, you put my suitcase in the in the car. Yes. First of all, okay, we're going to Mexico. The game plan. Okay, leave by four forty five. Right. I got there late, but she was not even up. I called this. <laughs> I woke up. I know she heard her phone. Sleep at 3.15, by the way. I did, too. I went to sleep maybe at 3.30. But you didn't work all what time day, what a time? long shift on your feet all day since 9 o'clock in the morning. You didn't Girl. You didn't have to go get your nails done and wait there for three, four hours. Anyways, anyways. 21, 22, for 23 times. 14, <laughs> 7, 1, 1. Is my phone on side of it? I was oh, sorry. Look, Taylor, say 21. Like, I was getting so pissed. I, ain't no way this don't hear her phone. 21 times? I ain't even never caught a 21 times. Right now, we're waiting on, we're waiting to be picked up to get to the airport. Kira's client lives in North Carolina, and she's going to take us to the airport. So that was nice. But I'm just very anxious to see how busy Charlotte Airport is. I've never flown, flown out of Charlotte Airport. I always fly out of Atlanta. So I'm very interested to see. But from where I live, Atlanta and Charlotte is the same distance. So we could really do either airport. And we have an airport where I live. It's just a regional airport. And I don't want to get on no small plane. And the planes at regional airports are usually tend to be smaller. So you might as well travel that little two hours. You get a better rate and you be on a bigger plane. So the game plan. We don't even have no itinerary, y'all. And y'all know that's not like me. But it just came up so fast. So the game plan is literally for us to get to the airport, get on a plane, and we're going to figure everything out like once we get there and stuff like that. I don't know if I want us dollars or pesos online it says it's smarter to use pesos because they can get over on you if you're using dollars but my mama say they want dollars so i don't know i'm confused all about that but i just want to check in with y'all to say good morning i got my vlog posted last night so there will be a vlog probably posted saturday which i'm super happy about and it's a long vlog it is 36 minutes i ain't did a vlog like that in a long time so yeah that's gonna be fun but yeah i'm just checking out y'all i got on my way to me in i love it but i have one critique my only thing i don't like is she almost made it too tall girl friendly and i don't want to complain but i'm a shorty i'm only five one so when stuff be too long and it bunches up at the bottom i really hate how it looks so i got it on and it's still cute, but I don't, I don't know how I feel about that. But I'll check in with y'all when I get to the airport. I can't even make no promises that I'm going to be able to record the check-in process and stuff like that. Because if it be too stressful, y'all know I'm not picking up no camera. So. Look at this. <laughs> Handy me. With the hood on. Bonnet still on. Long line. 
fine. Y'all, this line is not moving. We're currently on the way to get checkpointed. I'm going to be traveling a lot. I'm going to invest in TSA to check because I don't really like waiting. But I also realized I don't really like Charlotte Airport either. I prefer, they got a lot of construction going on and it's just like not working nice. I to stick to my roots and stick to flying from Atlanta because it's top tier. Y'all, I'm scared of dogs. You want to see somebody get caught. Where <laughs> they gonna stop? Have a great day. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Bye. Just went through TSA. Cancun. Oh, fantastic. You too. Shoot, give me good auntie vibes. Give me good auntie. Gator, we gonna be at. Oh, they got Bojangles. Okay, y'all, so it's almost time for us to board. We never ate. We got a little pan pizza, a little small personal size pizza from Papa John. They trying to get over on Gator today. Y'all. I just paid sixteen dollars for personal pizza and a water bottle. But well, mine was eleven dollars. But food in the airport do be higher. But why is Kira's only eleven? That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I was gonna go out that way. <laughs> so we're here. It is hot as I gotta take this big old bag upstairs because that's what we're gonna be doing everything and like getting dressed because we don't want to sleep downstairs. So I'm gonna try and drag this up there. It is so heavy. It was 60 pounds. But it's nice. It's I wish it was a little bit cleaner, but it's okay. But I'm about to take this up the stairs and then I'll give y'all a tour.
Y'all, it's so hot. We just took our clothes off. We got on socks. Y'all, it is so hot. It's nice though. I'm gonna give y'all a tour. I'm gonna get Kira to record MTV Cribs. But the lady just texted me and told me where the thermostat thing is. The remote. Oh. Oh. We got it. This five. Sixty. Like it feel like we in a sauna, like sweating. <laughs> really in the jungle. Like, ooh. This is definitely a culture shock. Definitely. I think it's definitely good to stay somewhere like this if you don't really want to stay at a resort. Because you're going to really feel like you live here. But it's tropical, all right? Up. Uh, Hola. <laughs> it's pulling down Yes, it feels good the wind is blowing. This is my villa in Tulum. So, first, you're gonna step in. It's a little loud because the fan is going. Come on in. So, this is the seating area. Have a nice little couch to lounge on. Ooh. And the TV is in here. So, you can watch TV. You're probably gonna watch the We gotta watch the event tonight. Yes, yeah, it's Friday. Okay, and then you come to the kitchen. Nothing too crazy about the kitchen, it's cute. And you have this nice little view of this little back area. Get into it. This is the other bedroom I didn't show y'all because my camera died. It's the pool. Where's the water? Stairs to go to the second part of the house. Let me see you walk, 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 walk. Wow, wow, yeah. So, this is the upstairs in the room. Pretty chill vibe, nothing much. It's hot as hell in here. They should have AC and big ones. Yes. It's cool. Little kitchen area. Okay, Mini here. kitchen. Then you have these stairs. Oh, and then you have this little room here. Okay. Yeah. Then you have this little room here. Okay. 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 So we're gonna yeah. try and clean it out because yeah. I could just see me coming out here at 6 a.m. Wind blowing. Period. And a little swimsuit. So we gotta get this one right. It looks deep. Way deeper than the other one. So girl it's can't given. swim. That's one of my goals is to learn how to swim. So you I ain't gonna go swim, so far Jenny? in that one. Mm. But it's little seating area. Lay it out. Real nice. Real cool. Okay. Excuse our mess, you guys. You know how it go when you unpack it. We have the upstairs bathroom. Super nice. It's given to the room. You have a little outside view. Showers are doorless. Real cute. Real cute. No it's vibe. given luxury. Period. Then we have the top bedroom. I think it's really cute. Real simplistic, you know the vibes. Then we have this little patio up here. I was looking for where the hell this sliding door was at. We definitely gotta get a picture of us like standing up here and then like taking a picture from down there. Yeah, type of vibe. Yeah, real cute. Keep the cat this is. <laughs> Hey y'all, so right now we're waiting on our taxi. I'm about to go for a swim. It feels good once you get used to it. I ain't got used to it. It ain't bad at all. It's not cold once you sit in it for a minute. I'm to go to the grocery store. Then when we get back, we're gonna get cute. Y'all, why I left my tripod in the Uber? I think I brought another one though. I think. I'm not sure. This high slide is different. Jumex. They got that in the US. It's good. But they still are in like a box. Y'all, we trying to get something that we don't have. That says pina, so like probably like pina colada. Let's get a small bottle. So we can get some cups. We passed the cup though. Maybe we can go down. I will go back. And look at that Gatorade 
They Gatorade so little and shit. I mean, but ours is like, nah, this is hard. But ours are shorter. He's done. I might do need to get me a little Gatorade though, cause I'm more of a power away. I need them electrolytes. Yeah, we got the power and Oh, boo boo loo. Boo boo loo boo. It looks like it's so That's chocolate. Dolce Gomas. So me and Kira both about to pick five things. We don't know what they say. We ain't even finna Google it. We just gonna go out for looks. And we both gonna try them. Cool. I like that challenge. I feel like we should do different drawings. We finna pick a chip. They said they Cheetos is way more like flavored here. They got a mix like what? That's not Puffs, cool. extra flaming hot bolitas. But we feel like we know what these taste like. Yeah, that's more common. Do you eat skin? I do not. I care about these, but when they say it, they talking about some mucho. <laughs> <laughs> they looking at Jada. He's gonna tap the man. They laugh. I say, oh, they talking about she thick as. <laughs> All that. <laughs> we just got back to the place. We got to put our stuff in the refrigerator, and we are gonna try them when we get back. Okay. Mm -hmm. You like the wine cold, right? Mm -hmm. Cause who drinks hot wine? Who drinks hot wine? Look at our lemonade, you guys. It's so good. Oh. Try these. We get back, but now we're gonna get ready. Excuse my gut, but said because y'all love to talk about it. Act like it's not there, okay? This is the first outfit we're about to go eat. I'm about to go put on these big old clonkers. Hill gotta be about to break because there ain't no way it's gonna be sliding like this. But yeah, ain't nothing going on. Y'all look at my feet. They shaking. We got to try these Mexican snacks. We went to dinner. It was disgusting. Nasty. It was so nasty. But we about to try these snacks. I really want, I really, how are we gonna pick which go first? I'm gonna go. Okay, let's try Google Google first. 
It's another one that I picked out. Okay. Okay, here pick boo boo loo boo. Boo boo loo boo. Red my dark chocolate. Sick. I don't give it a chance. It's the texture. It's not bad, but why do chocolate got a gummy in it? It got like a marshmallow type of vibe in it. Boo 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 boo. I'm not mad at this. I would give this a strong eight. Try your gummy worms. Jada mm -hmm. love for some damn gummy worms. I love sour candy. Look at sour candy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like, it's good. Why is it so soft though? It's the taste is good, but it's like I would munch on these though, but they really soft. They super soft. Like I'm eating them on pillow. Flavor to the ten for me. Taste is good. Texture give me giving me like a seven. It's, ooh, they so soft. They real soft. Like somebody sucked on them and then put them back in the cup. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know go. what it is though. We don't even know what it says. She just put it in. We don't know what that say. We got cowboy boots on the back. Oh, here we go. Oh, wow. Let's see what they feel like. It smells like a Chipotle. Hmm. Like Chipotle it don't smell bad. One, I don't hate it. It tastes like something. Mmm. That's good. What do it taste like? I'm feeling. Oh, America need to get like Mexico. All they stuff is recycled. Yeah. These are good. I'm scared. Oh, I'm like, when they say it's fire, it's say October, but it's like 22. Smell like strawberry? In a way. They look like strawberry. It's good. It tastes like a refresher. It tastes like watery strawberry. It, yeah, it just tastes like a refresher from Starbucks. I ain't never seen no Ritz. chocolate covered Ritz. I love Ritz and I love chocolate. Shake up. I like that. That's good. We need this in the U.S. They probably got it somewhere. That's good. You taste the rich too. Mm -hmm. I like that. That's good. This is good. Shout out to Holly Ray Premier. I picked these up. I don't know what this is. What it is. Can't even read. Bolitas. Let's Bolitas. guess. I feel like I had these before. Did you eat? Don't eat it. Oh. Mm. I've had these before. Ooh, it tastes old. It's like everything just more fresh. Like I actually like. I would drink that. It tastes like they say it bubbled up. It's like, healthy. Yeah, this tastes super duper fresh. This tastes like it's good. It's straight from the pineapple. I need some more of this. Mm. This tastes like well, you, you might want to fix this a little cup of that one. This would you. This would taste good with some liquor too. Yeah, it's like a little chaser. We was on there. Good. It's so soft. It's not sweet. It's not. She won't be. Gracias. No, then I. I see what they talking about. Mucho. Don't look like it's a pepperoni. But it's pepperoni. It's kind of hate. Man, got why? a condom on. <laughs> 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 oh, he's on camera. I was not you expecting it. You barely even bite it. Don't, don't, don't bite after me. 
No, I'll cook it. <laughs> they give me dog food vibes. It shouldn't be that hard to bite. It's giving dog food. <laughs> I do want to watch BMF, but you think you have anything to watch BMF? Not really, because I want to wait to watch it. You want to wait to watch it? Good night. <laughs> she just threw me off with that one. It's tradition. Um, we're going to watch it. You just couldn't say that. Well, All right. Y'all, look at the view. I might. The view. Baby, you don't know. Good morning. It's actually afternoon. It's 12. So we finna get up and find something to do. Definitely today we need to get a schedule for tomorrow because we gonna go to the strip today and explore. But for sure we going to a cenote tomorrow and the weekend. It's so bright out here. Initially, I was scared to go to sleep. I ain't gonna lie, I said I wasn't gonna go to sleep. But, you know what I did. But, I look tired, I still, like, I was slobbing, like, just doggish sleeping, like, that's how you know you're tired. But yeah, we finna get up, get dressed, get out. And, yeah, you know the vibes. All the way outside, just to get to the other part. today I'm just doing my makeup at this little area right here but it's brighter today so maybe it'll help before I do my makeup I'm gonna go ahead and do something to my hair I don't know how I'm styling my hair but I'm gonna go ahead and wet it so it could be drying by the time I finish my makeup I don't know how to tell like where the city is, I guess. I don't know, it's kind of weird. Cause you usually can tell like, okay, this is the city, this is where everybody be at, versus like, this is the rural area, this is kind of like residence and stuff like that. I don't really know how to tell the two. So that's kind of where I'm getting thrown at, so I don't quite know where to go. And with taxis, it's not like you can just call an Uber and an Uber gonna be right there to get you. You gotta find a taxi, wait on a taxi, like all that different stuff. So, and I'm the type of person, I ain't gonna lie, I like to put it out what I am. I don't like to wait. And that's my thing more so waiting for a taxi. I be wanting to go, go, go. I think I'm gonna put my hair up. I think we're gonna do an up situation today me to do my hair and makeup like I have to be sitting down looking in the mirror I can't I can't do it any other way let me take this thing off. go to my little station or whatever good morning or afternoon we're about to head to the beach area hopefully it's a lot of stuff to do out there because we need some food and we need some good food. So, we're about to head there, we're dressed. And then when we get back, we're gonna go to the pool. Since our makeup is already done, we can just chill for a little bit when we get back. I get to the pool and then we're gonna go eat at Taboo. Everybody say go to Taboo, go to Taboo, go to Taboo when you go to the room. So, we're going to Taboo. You get to the beach? Mm -hmm. They have a little good restaurant. Oh, by the beach? Uh, right in front of the beach. Right. You, you know so, walk. you walk through yeah, there? Right in front. Okay. okay, we're gonna be back. I want a shot glass, yeah, so we're gonna come back for it. Yeah. Doo doo doo! I guess he's gonna be the restaurant. He's probably his people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They um, he told us. They don't think we have emotions. They don't, they don't think, think we have money. money. <laughs> like, what? Talking about minimum 300 pounds. That's like $25. 20 That is funny. Ooh, boy, I should not wear no heels. I should just bought them little flip flops. Mm. They would have been flopping off, but at least a few would have been. These shoes not even uncomfortable, that's the point. It's just... Oh, I'm just gonna be barefoot, that's what I'm about to do. That'll save me the trouble, I'm about to take them out. Oh! <laughs> oh. Hey. 
gonna take my shoes off. Look at all that seaweed. First drink of the trip. It's definitely lime lemonade. Made. It's good with lime. I, I think I'm gonna start making my lemonade with lime. I think lemons aren't natural. Like they don't really use lemons like that. It's good. It tastes like straight lemonade. Ooh. I had to eat a fried shrimp taco. This is definitely not what I wanted. But I should have listened to what she said. Kira says it's good. It's so big. Best thing this far. I know it's good when I get there. a little bit. I can't swim, but she gonna swim. But we gonna do girls' hot. We gonna get topics. I never checked in when we got back, but we got back and took pictures and was chilling or whatever. We going to Taboo tonight. Everybody said go to Taboo, so we going to Taboo. And yeah, that's pretty much all we got planned. Tomorrow's gonna be a fun day. We up early with it, so. <laughs> be a nice little one piece when we go to the beach tomorrow so we can go to cenotes and i can try and fake like i know how to swim mm -hmm. <laughs> y'all i just hit my foot on this freaking bed and it hurts so bad dude on the way to our excursion when we went to puerto rico he played the best Dick Hero. Wait, or no way. <laughs> Y'all probably can't see me. But we back. Kira's asleep. But we back. That's all that matters. We made it here safe. 
finna go to sleep, wake up, have some cooked breakfast in bed. And then we starting our day, we're going to still no day. We're going all over the place, cause it's lit, period. early as hell because we up and at it today she's still sleepy but she got because we're gonna go eat breakfast look at my ankle y'all it's bruised it's literally bruised i'm probably gonna have to get that checked when i get back to the u.s but we got a simple breakfast we got bacon and eggs and waffles I tried to wash my baby hair because I had makeup all over him. I think I'm just going to do a flip over side part while we do exploring today because I don't got time to be dealing with nothing else. And I don't really want no pony. So, it's our last night here. We're eating at another restaurant somebody recommended to me. And, yeah. Y'all wake up to this every day. It's nice. But every day, I, I just need a little bit more privacy. I don't know if I could just have all this open space. Yo. You wanna say hey? Royal. Say hey. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Royal. I need you to be walking, sir. You be being. Look at the breakfast set up. It's really so good. Look at the breakfast, it's so cute. What's up? This is a um, maple syrup and a strawberry jam. This is the green juice. The mm. green juice? What's green juice? It's a uh, mix for celery and chaja. It's, uh, it's a plant for the red. <laughs> Like, just a little you? bit for me, please. Stop being scary. Why? Like juice. I'm a picky eater. Which is so crazy. We eat her picky eater. What try to say? Because the stuff you be saying that be good be so nasty. Girl, bye. <laughs> it's not fresh. It's good. Mm. You don't like it? It tastes good. I, I would drink this. Like, Working out. What's good? Tastes like something my auntie would put in her juice. It's something in it. Mm -hmm. Celery, ginger. That's why I taste ginger. Mm -hmm. Eggs are good. I love a couple of eggs. Hey y'all, so we're about to go to the beach. And then we're going to dinner in the sky. Dinner in the sky is not really dinner in the sky. It's really more so like drinks in the sky. So we're going to go to drinks in the sky. But we're about to go to the beach for the first time. We went and sat by the beach, but we didn't eat by the beach. So that's where we're about to go. Oof. Something around my neck. That's kind of tight. This baby suit's tied really tight. But that's because they don't really have no support. So I had to really make the girls sit up. But... This is our last day here. We're trying to make it very eventful. So we're going to try and see Cenote. We're going to try and do a lot of different things. So take y'all with us. And boom. Bikini or whatever. Gucci this. Gucci that. Shades. to the beach. Look at all this seaweed. Water in my lens. 
I got my other camera at home though, thankfully. So what you gonna do about that? Huh? Take it to the best. So we're leaving the beach and I gotta take my camera to Best Buy because I have water in my lens, sadly. But yeah, we're about to go to Tulum Tower. We're gonna do dinner in the sky. I don't think we're gonna get no food because they ain't take me back, but mm, we'll get drinks for sure. So I'm gonna get you a lit in the sky, y'all. <laughs> Wait, show. So we're riding your pegs. I don't know. Oh, bitch, ew. Look at birds again. I don't think this is right. Oh my god, it's moody hot. Oh, it ain't with me. Mucho. Mucho flamer. Is there another drink that comes in by that hotel? woke up trapping out the g7x because i have to go get hold on it don't look like no more water in there hold on let's see huh wow for real Okay, this is broken. I'm gonna take my SD card out because I prayed that my SD card still has the footage, but my camera is broken. It won't even turn on now. So I hope and pray. Why is it making that noise? And it's off. Oh my God. <laughs> I took the battery out because it's making a weird noise. That's so hurtful. Last night we didn't do nothing. We were supposed to go to dinner, but we just came here and and went to sleep. We didn't even notice we fell asleep. I look so crazy. I got this makeup on my face. I fell asleep in makeup. But I haven't ate nothing that was like super good except for at Taboo. So like last night we didn't want to waste money on food and not like it because we've been spending money. I spent $160 on food yesterday that I did not eat. Literally just me, myself. So with that being said, it just I'm ready to get to the airport, get some food. I need to brush my teeth and wash my face because I'm just I'm ready to get to the United States. Have fun, but it's time to go. Y'all, we leaving! Oh, I hate filming with this camera because it flips it. But we out of here. It's been real, but it's time to get back to the basics. But y'all already know I told y'all I'm taking a year off to travel. And I mean that. So, yeah.
All right, y'all, so I am back home. And I just want to close out this video because I never closed out the video with the whole camera debacle. But basically, I just came home and all of that. As y'all see, I still have not unpacked, but my goal is to finish that today. Um, But as just a, a synopsis of the trip, I actually had fun in Mexico. Next time, I probably will be more inclined to stay on a resort just because it's different. I always remember like when you're traveling just to be respectful of people and their culture and that know that that is their home it was definitely very interesting what i will say is the food wasn't really my speed but overall it was a really great experience most of the time i don't really travel to do this and do that and do everything i more so travel to really take in everything physically and just to see you know everything around me and just to really you know take in the culture and my environment i don't really you know that's my goal with traveling i just want to see the world i don't even got to be doing nothing as long as i can see it but yeah that's pretty much it i think um the outfits were given it was fun it was super duper hot but i don't really think i would do airbnb next time because I just will prefer to stay on a resort. I'll go more in detail on it if y'all wanna know like more about it. But I really just wanna go ahead and close out this video. It was very interesting to say the least. Um, And I don't know, I liked it, I liked it, I liked it, I liked it. But it was definitely more different than I expected it to be. Tulum, of course, is still developing, so it's not like, uh like you know the fancier resort type places in mexico so that was one thing that i kind of had to adjust to but it was still fun nonetheless and it was very spur of the moment and i really want to take a year off to travel when i graduate i just want to see the world i specifically want to go to europe paris and london are like my top two places that i want to go so i really want to make that happen but yes as y'all can tell, I don't know if y'all can tell, but I am shooting on a different camera right now. I'm on my Sony ZV-1. I'm contemplating on whether I want to take it back, so y'all let me know how y'all like the quality. I can't really tell how it looks because the viewfinder on this particular camera isn't as crystal clear as the Canon. That's the one thing that I will say. So, I don't really know how I'm looking right now. But yes, I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. I tried to get a lot of content, a lot of footage because I know y'all like to see those type of vlogs. Thank you all for watching. I love you all. And I'll see you guys in my next freaking video. Big ass, ass, ah, ah. Ooh. Let's go.